This is me and this is the first in a new series I'm kind of doing on between now and the end of my exams on the ologies. So here we go, starting off with what is an ology? And I guess like specifically an ology is a subject of study, like a branch of knowledge kind of thing. Where you kind of focus it like on one area like me where I'm fo kind of focusing like a so study, my studies on law. And it kind of came from the word logi, yeah, ology minus the uh, at the beginning. Now logi kind of denotes a subject of study or interest, like, like with me with my law. There's Denoting a characteristic of speech or language, as in eulogy. Now, eulogy, eulogy being uh, some kind of like a tribute to someone that's died, at least from what I understand. And the third and final definition of eulogy is denoting a type of discourse, like trilogy. Trilogy being like a series of three books. No try being free. And it's like logi kind of comes from the word French word of logi, L O G I E, but also comes from the Greek and medieval Latin word of logia, L O G I A. Now the word ology is a back form of, of like name of certain like certain disciplines and all, uh, you know, like the sciences, social sciences, political sciences, kind of, like languages, that kind of thing. Now, like the logi bit of it is a bit that means the study of some study study of something, like with like an ology logi has like. Greek, Greek or Latin roots. Now, when the with a well, from like the suffix of logia, which is kind of like in speaking, it's like to speak. And this word can also mean like study of ology. It's kind of like the suffix. Derived from like Greek logos, meaning like the study of like the speciality in or the art of giving art of, especially in like a scientific or medical field. It's just that is a thing. <laughs> as much as I know, like a lot of people, know, like some people might not like science and all. So yeah, and that's my quick introduction to this new series. So yeah, hope you enjoy it and I'll see you all very soon.